Hello from ChinDigital.com, this is Mark Josie. Today I'll be doing a gun review on this airsoft pistol here. This is one of the sexiest 1911 so far. <laughs> uh, it's the WE brand uh, 1911 replica called the Nighthawk. Okay, let's take a look. This is fully silver, shiny kind of pistol. With a very tactical look, uh, you know, all that tactical vibe um, with the black grip. Okay, also here, this little thingy, if you look closely, you can see the WE logo. And usually when you buy the gun, they have a sticker over it, so remember to peel that off to see the logo. Here you can see the, the uh, little design, the dot design. Very cool, nice texture when you grip it and cock the gun. Also here, yeah, very fun stuff. And look at that, the barrel. You can see the stamping. Okay, let me see. Yeah, you can see that, the stamping. Also, you got a sight. See, friend sight. Okay. The other side. Safety, I, I mean uh, make release, sorry. Make release. And texture it here for a nice good grip. Grip safety. Okay. It's metal, everything is metal. Nothing much is plastic except for the sight. And also here for the front sight, you see there's a red dot. Which is useless. <laughs> and also right here. Okay, here this spot here is a threaded uh, outer barrel, which is for the Canadian version. You can screw on that mock uh, silencer of the extended barrel. For the Canadians, oh by the way, also a three-hole skeleton uh, trigger, which is very cool. Okay, everything in this pistol can be disassembled like any other 1911 replicas, uh, like the ones in uh, Aragon. Okay. Like my tank focal witness or the Blackwater R2. Okay, they are very alike. Actually, this one and this one looks very alike. You see, this trigger. You see this trigger? Wow, almost the same. Okay. And that kind of tactical look and stuff like that. It really looks alike. Okay. So everyone, for the um, Canadian version of this pistol. It uh, comes with a extended uh, barrel and also a mock silencer right here, like that long. So it looks ugly and it's not necessary. So you can always disassemble the gun and put the stock barrel back on. It came with the stock barrel, of course. And then it will look like this. Very easy to do and took you about two minutes to do the, to the job. And also, just a note here on the magazine, it's a green gas uh, gas blowback pistol so you can see the magazine it's a full black magazine not like the CO2 mag with the little hole there okay. for your reference like the Blackwater R2 it's a CO2 gun you can see they have a hole here because you need the space to put the CO2 in and it's ugly it takes away the realism so here you go it looks like a real mag from far away and when you put it in it looks more realistic and also the gun here shoots uh, about like 300 FPS or so, just like normal kind of pistol power for airsoft gun. It's not very powerful, but the gun kicks really nicely. Okay, it doesn't kick as hard as the high kappa, but it's still a very fun pistol and very, very good kick. And here we'll inject some gas just to see the kick. So, King's Arm Green Gas. Let's go. Okay. Should be enough. Let's test it out. Just to, oh, by the way, black barrel. And I shot it a few times. Nowhere so far. Pretty good finish. Amazing. Take a look. See? Run out of gas. Yeah. As you can see the kick is pretty good. 
and uh, not bad I actually quite like the gun so let's take it to the range and uh, test it out to see the accuracy and stuff let's go hello everyone you can see that we have a penny here for reference and now we'll be sitting at uh, 15 feet to shoot at this target here okay I'm aiming for this target at 15 feet let's go Just like a 1911 pistol, aiming for seven shots, all grouped well. Very nice, eh, everyone? Just uh, take a look at that seven shot grouping and compare that with the penny. Very amazing. Uh, and uh, I'm shooting rapidly too, so that's pretty good. Now let's take a look at other kinds of targets. Okay, hello guys, so now we'll be trying this gun with other targets like this. This is a tin can and we're standing back a little bit just to see how it penetrates. Okay. Let's see. Very big dent. And... Okay, not that one. Okay, so it should be this one. Big dent, didn't punch through, but pretty good. Right, let's try that again. I loaded seven shot and it got to be finished. So. Okay. Very, very cool. Yeah, so take a look. At, oh, here you go, the new dent. Okay. Pretty nice, actually. The gun uh, gives you a good feeling, and yeah, pretty cool. Again, look at that seven shot grouping, pretty nicely. 15 feet, what do you expect, eh? It's a, an airsoft pistol. Okay. Okay, thank you for watching, everyone. Remember to subscribe and like. Bye bye.